Apostolic Christian Assembly Perambur Ministries presents Truth for Growth a daily devotional program God bless you as you prayfully listen to this brief biblical teaching for your spiritual growth Now Pastor Adam Samuel Ingleton will bring to you the infallible word of God Loving greetings to you in the incomparable name of the Lord Jesus Christ For our today's morning devotion let's read a very familiar scripture text taken from Isaiah chapter 41 and verse 10 The Lord says I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness We can hold on to the Lord Jesus that is fine but much better than that is to realize that the Lord Jesus Christ is holding on to us Think of this a little son may hold on to his father's hand but his father holding on to his little hand will make the child feel much safer isn't it if the little son is holding on to the hand of the father there is a possibility that the little child can leave his father's hand any time run away and endanger himself but if the father is holding on to his hands there's no way that he can run by himself and get into trouble My brother, my sister, you are the beloved child of the heavenly Father. The Lord God is holding on to your hand, so you have nothing to fear, nothing to worry. Now in a key text we read this morning, the Lord is not talking about holding on to our hands. He is talking about upholding us. Look at that verse again. Holding is different from upholding. We may hold a book or a pen. but we generally uphold something that is weak and feeble something which cannot stand on its own dear child of god we are weaklings in the hand of the omnipotent god without the divine help we cannot stand upright if we try to stand on our own we will fall that's why the lord jesus christ said you cannot do anything without me our gracious lord knows our weaknesses and so he has promised not just to hold us but to uphold us with the right hand of his righteousness since the lord is upholding us we have great confidence in the book of jude verse 24 we read now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy what a privileged people we are Though we cannot stand upright on our own, our Lord is upholding us that we will not fall. He is upholding us so that on that glorious day we may be presented before the presence of His glory with exceeding joy. Do you know how He upholds us? He upholds us as our heavenly bridegroom. Look at Song of Solomon, chapter 2 and verse 6. says, His left hand is under my head. and his right hand that embrace me if you attend a wedding service probably you think why the bride is made to stand always on the left hand side of the bridegroom the reason is song of solomon chapter 2 and verse 6 this is the reason the bride is made to stand on the left hand side of the bridegroom in a wedding service what a picture of a bridegroom our lord jesus christ upholding us with both his hands The one who upholds you with his right hand has the whole world in his hands. Why should you worry and fret? Leave all the matter to him. He will take care of you. Are you worried about your finances? Are you perplexed about the future of your son or daughter? Are you perturbed about your present health condition? Don't worry. The Lord will supply all your needs and he will take care of your family. Keep your hands free and allow the Almighty God, your loving Heavenly Father, to uphold you with His right hand of righteousness. God bless you and God be with you. Amen.